Hey guys, it's Carrie, and I am so excited for this video. I am back with some more Hatchable Collectibles Pet Obsessed. Uh, these are called the Hatchy Pet 2 Packs. I have to confess that it was my nephew that opened my eyes up to how awesome these actually were, because I overlooked them at first. I was like, oh, more Hatchables. Even though I am so obsessed with Hatchables anyway, um, the last season didn't really do it too much for me. I mean, I, lo I loved um, the Royal Snowball, but the Royal Hatch was kind of eh to me. It was too uh, girly. Like, it was too princessy. And I like that these ones are full of color and art, and they're appealing to both boys and girls at this point. Because that's where they started, I think. Maybe they didn't, but it felt that way. Um, let me just show you the boxes here. I think they're all pretty similar in color, yes. And I love that they have Snail Tail on the front, because he's my hero. <laughs> and then it looks like they have maybe... I thought that was ZBrush at first, but it's not. I think it's the other one. Um... Shoot, is Z Puffin or something or Zuffin? Yeah, I think that's Zuffin and Snail Tail there. And then on the bottom, who could that be? Chi Tree? It looks like the one that we're that's showing through here though is sparkly, and it looks like we have a hip hatch. So we're gonna open this up and stop blabbing, but let me just look at the back here. It says that uh, Hatchimal Collectibles collect 60 plus. Pet obsessed, pets have escaped into Hatchtopia. Uh, you get one heart and two hatches. Cute BFF poses you can connect. And there's a lot of stuff in French on the back of these ones, so I don't know. <laughs> and these are, of course, by Spin Master. The, 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 the master that makes all of the hatchable stuff. So let's just open this up and see what we got here. Okay, so inside here... We have a heart-shaped egg that has a really cool design on it. Let's see here. Uh, that I really don't want to open, but I'm going to because, well, how else are we going to know what's in there, right? I think that the designs on them mean something, but I'm gonna look. I'll take a look at that later. The back of this is also going to be able to be used, multi-used for a stand for one of your hatchables, because you know they don't supply it for both hatchables, just one. Uh, so this is hip hatch. We're gonna take a look at um, our checklist here. Figure out. So this is the instructions. It basically tells you how to hatch and play. Wait, hold hatch and play and don't eat the eggs because they're yucky. Not that I know from experience. I just do as i told. I just do as I'm told when it comes to things. Okay. So, the cool thing about these is you have your checklist on the back here, which they said uh, there is 40 plus to collect. You have Wild Duels, uh, Fantasy Friends... Heartland Honeys, Forest Faves, Kitten Smitten, Puppy Love, Tiny Pals, and I think that's it. And then on the bottom here, it says Unlikely, Unlikely Duel? I don't know what that means. <laughs> Anyhow, so the first one's going to be Common, and so it's that face right there is going to be Common. That, that right there is going to be a rare, that's an ultra rare, and then that's a limited edition. Hmm. Uh. Does it mean that those are going to be in there? Because I don't know. I, I don't... I don't see... I don't have a face one or a cloud one. Or one that has that on it. I guess this must mean that mine's common. It doesn't look like that, really. Does it? It doesn't look like that, really, but it's got faces on it. And then that one has paws. I don't know. None of those are the same as this, so I don't know. Maybe you don't know what you're getting inside these. Maybe they're just showing some of the eggs. Oh, wait, wait. I think the color of the egg is, is different, maybe? So this one... Oh, guys. I'm so confused. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take everybody out, and we're just going to look at everybody all at once. How about that? I think that's a great idea. So I have this pack right here that I'm going to open up with um, Lamlet. 
and this pack right here that has, it looks like, Birdle? I think it's a Birdle. And he's sparkly. And then I have this one that has uh, Ruby. I was so excited to find a Ruby. Uh, so yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, before I go into the characters that were already um, revealed in the package, I think I figured out the color scheme here. So, it's not so much the graphic in the front, it's the background graphic, I think. So, it's not the two faces in the front, it's all the faces in the background. So I think the, that this one right here is going to be a common. That this one right here... Is going to be an ultra rare, maybe? This is just me thinking. Me guessing. This one right here... Uh, has spots in the back of it. Could it be a limited edition? But that means this one would be two. I don't know, guys. I think... I, I think I, we're just going to have to find out. So let's just start with our, um... Are ones that are revealed here. So we have, we know we have a. Oh, I like how they sparkled him, but they gave him some paint detail. So check him out. He's a sparkly red, and he has uh, wings in the front that are. Can you can we even see this? But the wings are like a dark pink. So the dark pink is rare, and he's got this cute little sparkly star over his eye, and his shell is done in a orange color, but if you look close, you can still see the shell detail. I like that. I like that a lot. And it's not coming off of my fingers, so it's good. So he's an ultra rare. Where is he from? Not an ultra rare. He's a rare. So he's from the Heartland Honeys, and this is Bertle, and then this is his little, his little uh, mouse. And his mouse is a light pink sparkly, matching him with some creepy black hollow eyes. <laughs> He's a cute little meatball mouse. So it shows them just kind of shows them kind of like that on the um, picture. So I, they're supposed to hatch and connect or they're supposed to connect kind of like the hatch and connected but um, that's about as connected as they get. So let's go on to our next one. So this is the green hitch hip hatch in sparkles here guys. And he's a rare, and he's from the Tiny Pals, and he comes with a little hamster. The hamster has an indent on the bottom of him, and uh, he's actually like a purplish color, and he's got his eyes shut, so his eyes aren't as creepy as some of the other ones. And it shows him balancing on his head like this. So I think he looks pretty cute. Oh, next up we have Lamlet. And Lamlet, this is the pink version of Lamlet and, Lam and uh, the common version. There's another one, that, another Lamlet that is rare. Um, and Lamlet has this cool little eye tattoo that's done in blue. Looks like a flower. He, he comes with his little friend here, Lion. I don't know how they're supposed to set up here. Um, it just kind of shows him over here like that. I think she's supposed to be giving him a hug. So that's cute. And then here we have an absolute adorable version of Ruby. Ruby looks like she's sleeping. And she's got her eyes shut and her eyes are pink. Her eyelids are pink. She has a, a tattoo in the middle of her forehead. Closely resembling a flower snowflake. It's white. You can see that she has her rare pink colored rings. Unfortunately, mine has a little bit of um, color missing on the inside, if you can see that. It's more sparkle than color. I will be picky about it. And Ruby's just laying down in this really relaxed way, sleeping. And there's her little bunny. Her bunny reminds me of, like, those marshmallow bunnies. She looks edible. She's so cute. She still has a little... The, a little her eye has a little bit of... Um, it's a little mismarked on there. Not as round. But that's okay. Because it has to be okay, right? <laughs> So we'll snuggle them together. And now let's get into our our um, eggs here. So this egg has this really, there's really cool designs on them, but unfortunately, I gotta pop it through it. It doesn't have rubs on these ones, so I guess, ow, that really hurt. Watch your fingers, guys. Okay, so here's the first one. 
on this side. I think this is going to be our Hatchimal. So we're going to have, we're going to end up with a Hatchimal and then a Hatchimal, like, pet. Ooh, who is this? Oh, guys, we got Puppet! And she's, it's a really cool version of her. So she is um, yellow with a darker yellow on, like a yellowy orange uh, hair. And then she has a tattoo in her, in the middle of her forehead as well. Uh, ooh, they, the oh, I really like these a lot. They did a really some really good work with these. The painting is is outstanding. <sighs> they bounce them back. I was worried about them. Okay. Now what's in this one over here? I'll show you what we can do with these shelves later on. Let's just punch through this here. We can get through it. Arr. What have we got in there? It looks like we got a cat, maybe? So yes, this is the common version of Puppet with her cat. And it shows the cat on the head. Yes. It's from Kitten Smitten. And it just shows her on the head. Like that. I don't think it's going to stay like that on the shelf. What do you guys think? Okay, on to our next one. And here's our next egg that we have to hatch here. What do you, do you even call them eggs anymore? They're more like hearts to hatch. So we have a puppy here. Oh, it hurts. And that's our animal. If we looked on our list, we would know who we got on the other side. But this looks like a little puppy. Oh, it's cute. The eyes, though. Um, ooh, I like the, oh, I like the positioning of him here. I think this is Humming Bear. Look at that sun on his eyes. The sun tattoo. If you hear anything or see anything, guys, it's, there she is. There's Blaze's face. Uh, so this was done in pink. And he's squinting. Oh, really cute. And the belly's got the detail. I, I love how he's, I love that figure a lot. All right, so what is he from? I guess Puppy Love, right? Yep, this is Humming Bear and Puppy. Oh, I love his sitting position. You guys see that? He looks really, really good. He's a rare, by the way, guys. He's a uh, No, he's not a rare. He is a common. I forgot to share a close-up of the other one, but it's just, we looked at it already, I think. We're just, we're just punching through. Oh, what is that? Is that a Beeble? This is exciting, guys. Is there a Beeble even in this collection? I don't even know. I didn't really look through it that much. Who is that? Is this a new character? No, it might be Tigerette. Let me see. Uh, hmm. Well, we can tell by the character. I mean by the pet that comes with it. Yes, so this is Tigerette and Chinchilla. <gasps> Look at the Chinchilla guys, it's so cute. And this Tigerette is the rare, I mean the uh, common one. I love the striping they did on him. Oh, he looks so good. Guys, these figures are great. My nephew has good taste. All right. Um, yeah, so I'm going to put him aside here. Actually, I'll show you a close-up of him and his pet. Okay. Oh, and like the rest, on the last two seasons, guys, their heads are movable. So they're not a full figure. They're kind of like an action figure, I guess. But there's him. There's Tigerette. He looks really, really good. And we've come to our last um, egg in this video. Better hurry up, my, my battery's dying here. <laughs> it looks like we got a common Jero. And Jero is uh, done in orange with some light pink accents. You can see that dark pink flowery type thing on his... Um, on his eye. They did a good job with his body. Oh, he looks so good, guys. I can't even deal with this. And then we have a, a little... What is that? A sugar glider or something? I guess it's a chinchilla. I thought I already had a chinchilla. I guess maybe there's a couple of versions of chinchillas. But anyhow, he's really cute. He's done in a dark pink. And he goes with him, so they're cute together. So if Blaze would just move out of the way, I'll just show you a final look here. 
Okay, guys, that is everybody. Um, I wanted to get them all lined up nice, but Blaze is being a turd. Oh, and him over here. <laughs> Bye, guys.